What up, AKB for us. So we got Astros, baby. So Astros been that group that always has the music sounding very soft, like their whole style is being way too adorable, but I already know what I'm getting into by clicking on Astro, especially when the song's called Bebe. But let's get right into it. The store, seven drinks, Astro, Aroha. That's cute. Oh, look, it's all rainbowy. And sounds adorable. Sounds like Kirby. <laughs> It's like a groovy feeling. Hey, are you stalking me? Come in. Stalk me even closer. <laughs> Have some real high fruity looking drinks. It's like the sodas from their... Was it Breathless? It's a continuation. They change people into sodas. <laughs> I do have to say their coloring is, is very nice. I kind of wish soda shops, soda shops were still a thing, with like just different kind of sodas and candies from like all over the world. Because I need to get my hand on those Japanese Kit Kats. Oh, and they each have a designated color. Oh, how adorable! <laughs> He's like, "What are you doing?" Go away! <laughs> Oof, I could go for some I could go for some food right now. Okay. Is he the rapper? Is that also him in the green? No, he's blue. <laughs> See they have like the whole mosh pit like they're like Man children, I love it. That's the whole feel though, right? That's what Astra's about. They're supposed to be like these super nice guys. They look like dapper gentlemen. <laughs> See, like, they're doing. What? <laughs> it's got the Lego block. Okay, see, that just looks like. Is that how you make it though? The red flavor of soda? <laughs> <laughs> It's cool though how they had to get props that were like just matching the color, like the green dodgeball that's like the green M&M. &M. Oh, this could very well be an M&M &M commercial. <laughs> or Skittles. It's a very feel-good song though. I would say it's perfect for the season, but right now it's raining. Okay, you show off with your with your break dancing in your navy room. <laughs> See, they weren't there. They weren't there at the end. Because they are actually sodas. Oh, wait, here they are. <laughs> it actually reminds me of... <laughs> it reminds me of, like, a Froyo place um, that has, like, all the flavors you, that distribute. What was he doing there at the end? Hold on, what was he doing? Is he, is he signaling... What I'm signaling like, bye, no, really, go, like now, leave, leave, it's closing, I gotta go home, I gotta, I have some chores to do, you can't be here anymore. Rocky's definitely my favorite, I've always been in the rap, and his part was good. This falls in line with what I would expect Astro to do, very, 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 very adorable, where <laughs> you know exactly what you're going into, nothing too crazy, but still a fun song nonetheless. Now, I'm not sure how they could really take this a unique way without breaking from Astro style, but maybe in the future we'll see them be a bit more different uh, and deviate from their style a bit or uh, build upon it so it's it's a bit more different. 
I do have to say, I think I like this one more than Breathless, though, because I feel like Breathless was a little too adorable. This one was still very up, like, you know, on the up mood, and you feel good listening to it. But I, I don't know, I felt like it had different vibes when I heard it. I feel like, though, this song's a little too feel good for me to listen to on, like, a daily basis. But nonetheless, Astro's still a great group. And you could say they're one of our next generation, and they kind of made a name for themselves of what Astro should sound like. And I, that's, and that's kind of respectable, where they know what their fans are expecting. So... So good job, Astro, and I can't wait to see what else they have and see if they do build up or, you know, kind of maybe switch it up slightly in the future. If you like this video, please leave a like, and until next time, peace.